Hi! Welcome to my August TBR. All the books I hope to read in August, basically. I picked out five, as usual. The first one I picked out was The Nineteenth Wife by David Abersoft. This is about um, a woman trying to escape polygamy. I read another book about polygamy that I like that one so hopefully I like this one. It also has like a dual perspective so one perspective is the woman and then there's another um, perspective of a guy who's trying to figure out he's trying to discover the truth behind his father's death so it's kind of like a mystery as well. I don't really know how I feel about mysteries but hopefully this one will be good. The next book I grabbed was Ella Enchanted by Gail Carson Levine. I want to read this because I like the movie. Um, it's kind of like a Cinderella telling type thing. Spell on her where she has to like obey everything that she gets told basically. And she wants to try and like figure out how to get rid of that spell I believe. But it's funny, poignant, and enchanting so that sounds good. Valentine by Brenna Yavanoff. This is, um, I'll just read the back because I think the back kind of like sums up. The city of Ludlow is gripped by the hottest July on record. The asphalt is melting, the birds are dying, petty crime is on the rise, and someone in Hannah Wagner's peaceful suburban community is killing girls. So it's like a mystery again. But I don't think it's like too much of a mystery that I won't like it. It's just like suspenseful enough. So yeah, trying to figure out what's happening to all the murdered girls in our city. Or town, whatever. The one I grabbed was 20th Century Ghosts by Joe Hill. This is a collection of short stories. Um, they're like horror short stories. So that should be good. I'm not really into horror, but I don't think these ones are going to be like too scary, really. Okay. And then the last book I grabbed was The Annotated Ancient Mariner by Samuel Taylor Coleridge. This is a poem about, I don't know, a mariner, I guess. Like a sailor type thing. Uh, I read this in school, but I don't really remember what happened, so I figured that I would grab, read it again. But it's cool, because this one I found is annotated. So that means it's gonna like, it has like the poem, and then on the side and stuff it has like explanations, which is cool. They have um, an Alice in Wonderland that's annotated as well, which I definitely like to get my hands on. The library has it, so the next time I go back there, I think I'm going to pick that one up. Alright, so those are the five books I hope to get to, and of course there's always the ones that I have on my, like, that I own on my shelf, and when I get to those two. Yeah, so little time. So, so many books, so little time, so little me. <laughs> okay, see you later.